Just in the United States alone last year, we spent some 300 billion in wasted fuel and productivity sitting in traffic. By 2030, there's gonna be a doubling of the number of cars on the road in urban centers. We have to do something right now. I've taken leaders from NASA who have landed vehicles on Mars, as well as leaders from automotive. We've brought them together so we can mix the reliability of space with the mass producibility of cars. When I started at Ford, it was the mid 80s. There was people there that were there from the 60s. And if you look at their illustrations, the cars started looking like rockets. Will be both functional and beautiful. They were getting red. The way that I would like to describe the company is that we're doing what we can to reduce congestion on the ground by elevating people into the air. So it's basically a, a tilt wing aircraft that takes off vertically like a helicopter transitions to plane mode flight. Five times faster than driving for the same cost. You start to think how your life can be transformed if you have the ability to hop over traffic all the time. Companies that can figure out how to do that, do it well, and do it at scale, which is what we know how to do here in Detroit, are the ones that are gonna win. We have decades of experience under our belt, but we also know how to do things efficiently. We also know how to do things in a disruptive new way. Urban air mobility is the next big thing in transportation. Everyone wants to have the most advanced phone, the most advanced car. Well, this is going to be the most advanced way of transportation. That is what this is. This is the next step into the future.